All right, we're live in Frisco, Colorado for the Art Festival tour continues this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Main Street of Frisco shut down for a plethora of different artists. You're going to find Peggy Filio. Did I say that correctly? That is correct, yes. Sounds French. It is. <laughs> it is. I'm from France, so I came here about 20 years ago. Yeah. And my art is um, inspired by both culture. Okay. And w in France, I'm from the uh, oceanic side of okay. France, so I love incorporating blues, river, rain. Kind of water, just the exactly. water, the feel of the water. The freshness and the rejuvenating kind of part of the um, ocean okay. of water. So Peggy, what, what, let's talk, what got you yes. into artwork? What got you into doing this? Um, I've been in a family of artists okay. and um, I just enjoy painting. It's very soothing for me. I'm more of an introvert. So I like to be by myself and painting art that inspires me, but can also inspire others. And that's how it works. I mean, people are going to find, they're going to walk by and see something and come back and look at it again. And then, and then it, it, it resonates well. So you go from France to Colorado. This other it's painting more, has so more this, the of, second, a, of a mountain feel. Yes. The second one is more colors from Utah, Colorado, uh, earthy colors. Um, that really um, can resonate for people. And that's the reason why also I don't name my paintings necessarily what they represent because I want people to be able to uh, be inspired from what they feel rather than what I want to convey. So you can let the, art, the, the people that purchase your art name them. If they want to name them, they can, they what to. they get out of it, then they can. Yes. That's correct. I think that's pretty neat. Do you do anything custom for people in their homes? Absolutely. Okay. Uh, so as you can see, I do large paintings. The smallest that I do is three by three, uh, three feet by three feet, sorry. And uh, I did recently 60 inches by 72, which is five feet by six feet. So does someone say, hey, I have a space in my house and I don't know what to do with it? Absolutely. They tell me, you know, if their house is very modern, um, I can just adjust and um, create something that will uh, be part of their life. How long does it take you, let's say, for example, to take one of these from start to finish, on average? If it there depends. Is an average? I want to say A ten week? days. Okay, yeah, ten days. ten days from start to finish because there's lots of layers. You have to really feel the painting, and I want it to have texture, mix of colors. Um, and I really want um, uh, a well-balanced painting, so it takes it takes time. I think they're both beautiful. They're both beautiful, and I can Thank see I can see the blues and the, the the richness of of the oceanic part of France, and then more into the mountains. I love it. And the texture. And the texture it's... for sure. And you can't see the texture unless you're like staring down over the top yes, of it like this. It's, it's three-dimensional for sure. That's correct. Yeah. What's your website? It's Filio. F E L I O T hyphen uh, art dot com. Okay. And you're going to be here. So come by and see Peggy and the beautiful artwork, her France inspiration, Colorado inspiration here at uh, the, the 2018 Frisco Arts Festival. Or go to artfestival.com to find out more.